Hey, everybody. I have five questions to give you today that will make you money and help you grow your business um, always. And here they are. Number one, can you please make an introduction for me? A lot of times people have a hard time asking for referrals because it just gets a little bit uncomfortable. But in the right space, if you can ask somebody for an introduction, it really goes a long way. Mr. and Mrs. Client, can you make an introduction to somebody who can uh, benefit from the services that I'm providing you? Next question, how will technology change your business and industry in the next five years? This is gonna be um, something that you wanna be asking yourself on a very regular basis. Right now, technology, I can tell you, is going to change it in a massive, massive way with artificial intelligence and um, all of the um, the chat, uh, the chat and the Jaspers and the, all of the AI uh, stuff that is basically at phase one right now is going to be something that we can't even comprehend what's going to look like in five years, let alone all of the software and technology and the virtual reality and the augmented reality that's going to change our business. We must stay on top of this question. Next is, who are the decision makers? When we are presenting a proposal of any type, we always want to be asking our clients, um, are there anybody else uh, uh, that um, you think would benefit that can come to our proposal meeting, it's always good. We find that our clients find it very beneficial when they have all the decision makers at the table so they can ask all the questions that they need so they can make the best, most informed decision. Also, something that we always want to know, especially when we're uh, doing any proposal or talking to new clients and prospects, is who are we competing with? This is something that for some reason people don't like to know or ask because they think it's 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 going to um, help them. It's going to aid in them losing the business. But really, when I know who I'm competing with, I'm never talking poorly about a competitor. I know how to focus on my strengths. I know the questions that I need to ask the clients so I can get them to really understand my strengths as a company and how that client will specifically benefit from those. And the last question is, do I have the right team in place? You always want to think in a very client centric way. Do I have the best team, everybody within my company and maybe even outside the walls of my companies uh, of my company, maybe other vendors that can benefit um, this client by me facilitating the best team for the client that is client centric. Use these five questions to grow your business and have an amazing day and always think big.